Welcome to Investing with Larry Living Large. This is the second of Mini Mogul's three volume adventure series where you will be introduced to the fundamentals of financial planning. The Mini Mogul series will help you to understand and value entrepreneurship while it prepares you for academic success. Now, let's go to school. A school that's a lot like yours. Larry has been selected to share the secrets on his success with his fellow students. Man, there must be some way I can share my good fortune with my fellow students. Pedro, watch where you're going, man. Sorry, amigo. I got a lot on my mind. Oh, paper pushing Pedro. You've given me an idea. I could use your help on a project. Are you in? Count me in, amigo. And for what? If it's news, I want to be in too. Madam Class President, always looking to get her ink. <laughs> but will she turn on her persuasive power for another purpose, like selling an idea to the masses? Are you kidding? I can use the exposure. All right, all right. The financial dream team is set. Meet me in the school auditorium at 6 o'clock tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, Welcome to Are You Learning Middle School's production of Just Another Day on Wall Street. Produced, written, and directed by yours truly, Larry Livinglot. We open with Paper Pushing Pedro conducting business at his newsstand. Man, business is great, but I need space for more inventory, plus some help running the stand. I need money to grow, but where can I get it? Hi! My name is Cynthia Michaels, and I'm an investment banker with Michaels & Michaels Investments. I would like to talk to you about expanding your business. You read my mind, but what's an investment banker? Good question, Mr. Pedro. Investment bankers are people who help business owners like you raise money to expand their business. We do this by taking your company public or selling your business on the stock exchange. No, my business is not for sale. Adios. Wait, wait a minute. We won't sell your business, just a percentage or share of ownership in your business, or what we call stock. Stock? You mean inventory? No, Mr. Pedro. Stock represents a share of ownership in your business. For instance, we could create 10,000 shares of stock for a company, let's call it Pedro's Papers Incorporated. You will own 6,000 shares, which means you own and control a majority interest in the company. We would then sell the other 4,000 shares to the public through the stock market, and you get the money from the sale to expand your business. Minus, of course, a small commission to me for selling the shares for you. But who would buy shares in my business? Just leave that to me. This is where I come in. Do I have a deal for you? Are you hungry for money? Man, I'm so hungry I can eat a grizzly bear. What's cooking? You know Paper Pushing Pedro's newsstand? It's a diamond in the rough looking for a buffer. I'm all ears. Business is booming at Pedro's, and he needs to expand his space. He needs to increase his inventory and hire some more employees to make the kind of profits dreams are made of. Mr. Pedro has hired me as his investment baker, and I'm taking him public. Sounds appetizing? Well, not a four-course meal, but a good midday snack. Count me in. Hola, Pedro. Buenos noche. How's my favorite investment banker? Congratulations. Today, you are on the stock exchange as the Newspaper Cafe Incorporated. And your ticker symbol is NC. Whoa, what's a ticker symbol? Oh, that's just an abbreviation used to list your company with the stock exchange. So when someone wants to buy your stock or follow it in the newspaper, they can find you under this symbol. Wow, what's next? Okay, here's how it works. 
you had an initial public offering or IPO of $10 per share. So your shares are worth $60,000. And Larry Living Large bought 3,000 shares worth $30,000. And there is another 1,000 shares left in the treasury. Treasury? What treasury? Well, that's where you keep shares owned by the corporation to be used at a later date. That means I have $30,000 to expand my business? That's $30,000 minus my fee, of course. Hey, Larry, how you doing? Well, that depends on what my favorite stockbroker has to tell me. Man, how's my newspaper incorporated stock doing? It's in the stratosphere, baby. It opened today at $35 for a share. That's a cool profit. Sell 2,000 shares at 35 That's a $40,000 profit for me in just two weeks. Man, that ain't bad. And everyone made out. Pedro got his money to expand his business. Cynthia earned a commission for putting the deal together. And Larry got a nice return on his investment. And are you learning middle school? Got a good example of how business works. And that's why they call me Larry Living Lord.